Hi, Andy Cotman here. A 60 pound pike. Can you imagine? The UK had a massive pike of 60 pound at one time. Can you imagine catching anything like that now? It's possible. All you pikers out there, do you know your history? Have you heard of the Dowdersville Pike? Massive pike that was found on the shoreline dead in a decomposing state in 1896. Now, it was four foot six inches long. Now, get your tape out. Get your tape out and measure four foot six. Now, you can lay a couple of inches shorter than that, perhaps for the fork of the tail. So, you know, massive fish, whichever way you look at it. It was found on the shoreline of Dowdersville Reservoir, which is about five miles outside of Cheltenham. It's at the Cheltenham Museum. Huge pike. It doesn't look in a very good state, but then again, it was decomposing at the time. And it's estimated at about £60. I mean, they couldn't weigh it, most probably fall to bits at the time. But a huge pike nonetheless. So this country has had some huge pike at one time. Now, is there pike like that about now? I think there might be. A 50 pounder, really possible. 60, well, it might be pushing it a bit, but who knows? But with these big reservoirs we've got now, and that's like trying to find a needle in a haystack. You need several hundred pikers on the banks or on boats, fishing all at the same time, as many hours as possible to try and locate these big fish. And I think one day a 50 pounder will come out somewhere. Cool, well, what a fish that would be. <laughs> yeah, 40s have been caught. But it's going to be a day somebody's going to catch a 50. And what a sight that would be. I used to catch a lot of pike. Some days better than others. And I tried to catch big pike. We all dreamed of catching a big pike. Yes, I've got medium sized pike. And half decent sized pike. My father, he's caught just short of 30 pound. Carp are getting larger all the time, so surely pike should be getting large as well. But with carp, well, there's bucket loads of dustbin loads of boilies and that being chucked in these waters every week. So all these carp are getting fed all the time. It's a different matter with pike. But if there's good stocks of silverfish or trout, then a big pike is possible. Anyhow. Get the hours in, fish the right places, who knows, it could be you.